Whether you're interested in the latest designer labels or just want something comfortable to wear, clothes are a basic necessity of everyday life. But how many of us know the full story behind how our clothes are produced? In the former Soviet Republic of Uzbekistan, one third of the population are forced to work for the state-run cotton industry. Most are children. Schools are shut down as boys and girls as young as seven are made to work 70-hour weeks. A lack of modern machinery means that the majority of cotton is picked by hand and it's back-breaking work. Every child must fulfill strict daily quotas. Many students have said that we are like our slaves and we are tired, we want to go home, we are hungry, we are cold. Separated from their families, the children are housed in Soviet-style labour camps. With no access to clean water, many risk poisoning, drinking straight from irrigation canals. Europe buys one-third of Uzbek cotton contributing $350 million annually to one of the world's most brutal regimes. In May 2005, government forces ruthlessly crushed a pro-democracy demonstration, killing over 500 innocent civilians. The next time you buy new clothes, spare a thought for those who bleed and sometimes die for them. Ask your retailer where their cotton comes from. Only purchase organic and fairly traded products.